Now turn to section one. Section one. You will hear a tutor and two students discussing the best ways to study. First, you have some time to look at questions one to five. Listen carefully to the conversation and answer questions one to five. Well, how are you both settling in? Fine. Yes, no problems. So far, anyway. Good. Remember that as your personal tutor, I'm here to help you if you do have any difficulties. Now, as you know, lectures start on Monday, so I thought we'd look at a few ways of making the most of them. Especially in terms of the notes you take, let's begin by thinking about what you can do before you even go to the lecture. <laughs> Any ideas? Um, make sure you're up to date with all the background reading, so you know plenty about the subject already. Yes, that's essential. The lecturer will assume you have that knowledge. Anything else, Carlos? Well,、uh, check what the topic's going to be, of the lecture, that is. I'd go a bit further than that and consider what the content may be. Then you could ask yourself some questions that you want answering, and listen out for the relevant information during the lecture. Okay. Now that brings us to the lecture itself and the actual business of writing notes. But there is a lot to deal with there, so we'll come back to that later. What I'd like to do for the moment is continue with the process of note taking and move on to the next stage. Any suggestions for what that might be? When the lecture is over, you mean? Yes, once you're able to sit down somewhere quiet with your notes.、Uh, read them. More than that, you need to make sure they'll still make sense to you weeks, months later. Edit them. Yes, that's what's needed.、Mm. It's well worth spending a few minutes on it. Any missing words, anything difficult to read. Things you didn't have time to jot down. Now is the time to do so, while everything's still fresh in your mind. Right, and after that, when's the best time to revise them? When do you think, Carlos? Um, I'd say just before the next lecture, in the same subject. Precisely. <laughs> That's a vital time to look at them again for obvious reasons, but it's definitely not the only time. When should you revise them again? A month later, maybe.、Uh, sooner, and much more often than that. I'd recommend you look at them again once a week. That's why it's so important they're complete and easy to follow.